Hello everyone, in this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you are going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So why don't you use your calculator? So here is a problem, we have 2 minus 2 times 2 minus 2. And of course most of you out there are like, yes I can handle this, I can handle this problem, it's basic multiplication, basic subtraction, and I can easily solve it. So let's go ahead and write your option uh, down in the comments. Over here we have A, B, C, a lot of options, and I suggest you to choose one correct option, what do you think, and we will check our answer in the end of the video, and I'm going to show you the correct answer here in just one minute. Okay, and I'm going to emphasize this extremely important math topic. Okay, so first of all, I want to start with the main obvious mistake right here. So we have 2 minus 2 times 2 and minus 2. Yeah, so we have this question. And the main obvious mistake right here, maybe a lot of students do this mistake, this is main popular mistake right here. They say, okay, 2 minus 2, this is really great, this is equal to 0. And they say, okay, 2 minus 2 in the end, this is really great because this is as well equal to 0 as well. And then there times 0 equal to 0 and they say okay the correct answer is option A. So as you can see obviously whatever order you select is going to create a different answer right so we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem and this is the main thing right here and this is a video about this question so right here we have pmdmc order this is the main popular order in the world and the most internet libraries maybe a scientific calculator graphing calculator work with this according to this PMDMC order. So let's let's look at this order and let's try to solve it step by step. So I, I read this problem once more. So 2 minus 2 times 2 minus 2. So here is the problem. What is the first step according to this order? The first step is parentheses. So what about parentheses? Are there any parentheses right here? No, I don't see any of those. So we just skip this part. And then we have exponent. I don't see any exponent. I don't see any squares, any cubes right here. So we don't have any of those. So we just skip these two part. Then we have multiplication and division part. And if you look closely to this, we don't have division sign, but we have multiplication sign right here in the middle. So we need to start with this multiplication at first. And this is the main thing right here, because if we start with, the, with this multiplication, we will have 2 times 2, we, know, we all know this, equal to 4. Yeah. In the end we have minus 2, and in the beginning we have 2 minus. So we still have these values, these numbers in the beginning. Yeah. So but what about this? This is not addition, this is subtraction from left to right. This is classic, classic moment right here. So 2. And moreover, if you know a really good trick, so we can easily cancel 2 and minus 2. Yeah, and you will have like minus 4, which is absolutely correct answer according to PMDMC order. And as I told before, as I told before, the 0 is incorrect answer because this is a wrong order of operation. But then I, I, I ask my students, okay, what do you need to put right here to get this 0? And they is the answer, okay, ex maybe exponent, I say, okay, no, what exponent? But parentheses, yeah? So if you put parentheses right here, we need to start with this one because this is the first step. So it doesn't matter, maybe we'll have like bodmas, yeah? So if you have bodmas, you need to start with parentheses and in PMDMC, you need to start with parentheses, yeah? So we start with parentheses, zero, right here, zero, and you will have like answer zero according to PMDMC, but we have parentheses. In our case, we don't have parentheses. So correct answer is minus four. So I write this answer right here, and I hope you understand this explanation. This is option C, minus, minus four. And I, I, I hope your answer is the same as mine, which is really, which is really good. But definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong, okay? Now if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain test, IQ question, right? If you're struggling with basic math or like pre-algebra concept, you can easily subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. And it helps me a lot. It inspires me a lot to make really interesting viral math problems from the whole world. So I definitely wish you all the best in your mathematic adventure. So thank you for your time and have a great day.